the half regions x greater than 0 and x less than 0 are filled with dielectric media of different dielectric constants epsilon 1 and epsilon 2. There is a uniform electric field in each part. In the right part half, the electric field makes an angle theta 1 to the interface, the corresponding angle theta 2 in the left hand side. Left hand side. So we are now asked to find which equation satisfies this relationship. So we know that, let me solve it here, we know that the normal component of the dielectric constant vector d is continuous across the boundary. So d, okay, so that is the perpendicular component is continuous across the boundaries. So therefore, I'll write, so the perpendicular component is d1 sine theta, right? The sine theta is the perpendicular component. Theta1 is equal to d2 sine theta 2. And then we have the tangential components of the electric field are also continuous across the boundary. So that like this is the tangential component. So uh, by this equation, we can write E1. So we, the tangential component is always the cos theta component. So we have so what we do, we'll say this is equation one, we can say this is equation two, and this I can actually use the relationship between D and E. D is nothing but epsilon E, right? So I can write this as epsilon one E1 sine theta 1, epsilon 2 e2 two, sine theta 2. So this I'll call as equation 1. Now let me divide equation 1 by 2. So, so 1 divided by 2 we get epsilon tan theta theta 1 is equal to epsilon 2 tan theta 2. So this is your right answer. So the right option here is given by the option C.